So it started out as a dream, ladies and gentlemen, and then that dream became a reality. I was the owner of my very own restaurant, and then the restaurant business, it got shut down. I wasn't making enough money. I wasn't paying my employees enough. People were rampaging in my restaurant. So then I had to shut down the business. I moved over to a arcade and I started a successful arcade, but people weren't happy enough with the arcade. The machines kept breaking down. People demanded golden and rainbow machines. So now I'm taking a break from the arcade, but I'm not shutting it down. I still have a strong belief in my arcade, but today I'm bringing you guys a brand new experience. This is called my supermarket, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> my supermarket. Look at the title, B-Skills 149 Supermarket. I am really, really living the dream here in Roblox. Any job that I want to have, I'm going to have it. So as I told you, I wanted to own my own restaurant. I done that. I wanted to have my own arcade. I done that. I wanted to open up my own car dealership. I done that. And now I'm running my very own supermarket and it's going really, really good for a first day, um, you know, attempt at it. I'm level 20. I've been grinding for several hours now. Got 4.7 mil in the bank. And I got Demon Desire here. She's been also grinding with me, also helping me out in the live stream. So huge shout outs to her. Ashley just came by. Huge shout outs to her. I haven't seen her in a while. There goes Batman. A couple doges. We have Spider Man in the building. It's so much going on inside of this supermarket, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to take you guys in there. But before I actually do that, please drop a like on this video please subscribe to the channel right now if you guys are new and also hit that share button as well shout outs to the creators of this game right here so i'm gonna leave a link in the description for anybody that hasn't yet tried the game out for themselves as you guys can see there goes spider-man about to enter the supermarket and we got the doge leaving with two bags in its hand that is really really amazing and look at this little girl <laughs> Look at this little girl. She's all by herself. And she has two shopping bags. Wow. Oh my gosh, she's so tiny. And she just got inside this Cadillac. <laughs> oh man, I love to build on this, ladies and gentlemen. It's more than just a plain supermarket game ladies and gentlemen because there is a whole bunch of stuff in the background that you can actually go into so as you guys can see some of these buildings you can actually enter there's a maze over here there's a carnival there's um some construction going on there is a lot of things going on over here at my supermarket and this is amazing. This is a really, really good game. I enjoyed my arcade, and I'm still playing that game, but I'm also playing this game as well. This game just came out, and I've been grinding, yo. I've been super, super grinding. As you guys can see over here, we can expand our supermarket. So I might, I'm, I might think about doing that. Right now, I'm just trying to gain as much cash as possible so I can purchase more upgrades and everything like that, and you know, get more shelves and groceries and stuff like that this is the cutest thing I've ever seen wow <laughs> that is the cutest thing ever bro all right so let me take you in here and show you guys around it's a little busy so first off as I mentioned this is my first day and basically right now this isn't how the supermarket is gonna look this is just a start right now I'm just randomly placing things everywhere there's no owls that's you know together and everything like that everything is just thrown around so as you guys can see we got some cashiers we got some workers over here restocking the shelves and everything like that over there um, we got bunch of different types of shelves so over here you guys can get um, teddy bears and stuff like that 
Um, you got some fruits. You got some cheese, in which no one's buying cheese. Um, you got some sausage links. You got Roblox puzzle pieces. Um, what else is over here? We got tomatoes, watermelon. We have water. We got um, blocks of ice. We got some more grapes. Uh, we got pet food as well. If you guys got pets, um, we got milk. We got toys over here. We got raw meat. We got rotisserie chicken, little whole chickens. Um, we got bananas. We got corn on a cob. We got some chips that looks like Lay's. Um, we got some bread rolls. That's some baguette rolls, I believe. Um, and we got pumpkins. <laughs> we also got some beverages over here as well. We don't sell any alcohol. So if you guys are over the age looking for that stuff, that is the wrong um, place to be looking. Uh, we got more meat over here. We got more dog food and stuff over there. And we got some stands over here. We got apples. We got carrots. We got more cashiers. We got some flowers in the front just in case you guys want to buy some flowers for your mom or something like that. A um, bunch of, you know, other th things in here. I was trying to figure out what the heck that NPC was doing. So these guys are moving fast because I bought Boost. Now, let me show you something, ladies and gentlemen. The Boosts are actually worth it. So right here, I bought this entire top row for 120 Robux. So super customer buff 50 percent you got super shopkeepers super cashiers and then cash buff this is two times the cash with all of this going on this allows everyone to move faster so the customers they come in faster the um, cashiers they ring up your um, groceries and everything like that a whole lot faster these guys are stocking the shelves a whole lot faster so i would definitely recommend spending robux up here in the boost now I haven't gotten anything down here, but this says two times the luxury cashier register, two times the premium cashier register, and ordinary cash register is two times. So I believe this is just basically giving you two times the money for all these different registers that you have. There is also VIP in this game. Pretty much it works just like how it worked in um, my restaurant. You're gonna receive, you know, certain um, stuff inside of the store that other players don't have access to um, having. So my friend Demon, she has um, VIP right now, so she has access to a whole bunch of other stuff that I don't have access to. And for a first day total today, we serve 3,161 customers. So that's really, really cool. Um, you have the theme park tycoon sort of you know the team what is it called the theme park tycoon sort of um you know this thing here where you can leave a like on someone's you know place um so when i used to play um theme park tycoon 2 not the first one the second one um people will come by your park or whatever and they would drop a like on it if they liked it so you can do that here with the uh, supermarket as well and then outside of here, you have your teleport straight to the center store, which is the um, center where you're going to be purchasing all of your accessories and stuff like that for the supermarket. And I keep getting teleported back here. They don't want me to leave. All right. So before we go up in here, as you guys can see in the background, there's a racetrack over here. You have the group reception over here. If you join the group, you're going to get um, some pretty cool stuff over here. Now, I'm actually not a part of the group, but it does show you, as he said, you can get rewards every day. So it might be different things that you can get every day from, you know, there. So just join a group and find out exactly what it is, and then you can tell me. So that way, maybe I can leave one of my groups and join the group. Over here you have the leaderboard, so you have the most likes on your restaurant or your supermarket, excuse me. You have your customer leaderboards, and then you have your player level leaderboards. So the highest level right now, globally, is 64. So this player, Luke Kang, 0315, has 64 on the level. That's, that's pretty impressive. But this guy probably had either early access or was a tester 
or he just grinded the game and spent a whole bunch of Robux. Either way, I'm not going to hate. Shoutouts to that person for getting, you know, top on the leaderboard for levels. But he is number two on customers. And for likes, I don't see him up here. But I do see a YouTuber friend, Carbon um, Mister, over here at number seven. Carbon Meister. Meister. I usually say Carbon Mister. Either way, you guys know who I'm talking about, probably. <laughs> um, if we want to make it on this thing, we're going to have to grind a lot. All right, so now let's enter the center store, but let's look at this sign. So this is VIP right here. It costs 400 Robux, 10% off your shelves in the central store, exclusive VIP style, supermarket name. Um, I'm not sure if you can see Demon's name in the distance, but she does have the VIP tag next to her name. And then lastly, it says unlock exclusive VIP items to purchase. So as I said, when you go up in here, there's going to be a section where other players won't be able to purchase certain things that's over there because it's VIP. And as a matter of fact, VIP stuff is actually upstairs. So in this game, you have a moving escalator and you have a elevator that works. So that's really, really cool. So now, if you want something, an item, you're just going to walk up to it. You're going to see the price and you're going to see how much you're making for that product that you're purchasing so if you purchase this freezer it's gonna cost you 89 and then every cell of you know a gallon of milk or whatever it is you're gonna get this much poor so $16 per cell basically so that's not bad and then they show you that um, everything in here is sectioned off by your levels so right now I'm level 20 so I have everything over here unlocked we got fresh raw meat we got bananas dog food as I mentioned and you have your bread rack sausages your chicken everything starts to get more and more pricey but as you guys can see some of this stuff back here it earns me more per cell so even if a customer comes by and gets a roasted rack of chicken you know this whole chicken right here even if they buy one I just made four thousand off of that so the more they buy the more I make and trust me, some of the customers, they do buy multiples of things because I seen Batman, all he was buying was just a bunch of sausages. Like, it was very weird for him to just buy a bunch of sausages, but he was clearing out the whole rack. And of course, Bruce Wayne is wit. You know, he's, he, he's rich. So, <laughs> over here you have your cheese rack. This is like probably imported cheese. That's why it's so expensive. But look how much I'm making per cell. So 6,000 every time someone buys that. And then over here we have the um, steak racks. So I haven't actually bought any steaks. That's what I need to buy right now. And then we have sushi. Wow. Fresh fish pack. So these two things, they cost a lot over here. And we got some cans of food. It's a whole turkey inside of a can, bruh. But look how much I'm making. 20000 a sale. So I'm going to have to get this. Then we got some lollipops over here. I don't know why this costs so much. But then we have some toys. So I got to get one of these. That was part of one of the little um, quest. So that just cost a lot just now. <laughs> um, I'm going to get one of these as well. That just cost a lot too. Um, but it's all going to be worth it, you know, it's all going to be worth it. Alright, so, let's start off with those two for now. And then if I take you to the other side, as you guys can see, so this is about to open up. This is level 21, so we're going to have, like, water guns, um, some detergent over here. What's over here? Um, okay, we got some cutlery and some plates. And we have, uh, I hope those are toys toy swords <laughs> and then of course you have more stuff coming soon you have a car in the middle now me and demon were actually discussing this this would be cool if you know this was something we could like buy because as you guys can see there's a vehicle button but when you press that it spawns in a segue 
I mean, this is, this is really cool. I love this. I love things like this in Roblox. That's really, really smooth. Look how I move around with this throughout the store. This is really, really cool. But this car, it would be awesome to be able to purchase it or give it to, you know, the top players or something like that at the end. That would be really nice. Okay, so you have level 51 where you have some higher tier stuff in here. So we got games over here now. The supermarket then turned into a ultimate, like, outlet store where you can purchase every single possible thing. You got toilet paper over here. Ice cream. What level is this? Level 26. You got basketballs. You got some sweet surprise stuff. I don't know what's the surprise in it, but I hope it's good. <laughs> you got soccer balls over here. Sunglasses. You got some shoes. You got more um, sports apparel stuff over there. So this is really, really cool. Um, we got books over here. Um, what is this? Oh, microwaves. This is level 71. So this is when you start getting really, really amazing stuff we got phones for sale over here wow and i think i got my thing stuck oh and we got tvs what bro i like how i'm just going over things with this we got tablets over here yo this is crazy we got musical instruments is that a flute and a guitar and a saxophone yo <laughs> Oh man, this game is going to be really, really awesome to play, ladies and gentlemen, especially when we level up. So as I told you guys, we have an escalator and we got an elevator. So we can actually go up. This is really, really cool to go up with the Segway. I feel like a mall cop. <laughs> then you have the VIP stuff. As you guys can see, look at this VIP lounge chair right here. You could just literally have this sitting inside of your supermarket and you sit up there and you're just watching over everyone then you have a golden cart rack um, this is a golden restock shelf this is um, a statue I believe like a golden cat statue this is a VIP statue then you have these like ropes as well neon ropes you have these um, I forgot what these are called but I've seen these in restaurants before these things they do cost a lot then you have more stuff that's going to be coming up here in this space and they're probably going to have this thing going up and up and up as well. And then you got um, light fixtures up here as well. And also, I never seen this when I came up here, but this looks like you can change the color of your floor tiles. So that's really, really cool. Um, let me know what you guys think about this game so far. Um, let's actually take the elevator down so I can show you guys that it actually works. Alright, so here we go. Can I, can I get on? All right, I think I can't get on with this. So I might have to leave that here in the store. It's gonna suck. All right, so as you guys saw, I just came from the second floor and now I'm back down on the first floor. All right, no worries. We could get our vehicle back, right? Then we can just go right back over here to um, teleport back to our restaurant. But let's see. All right, we got our segue back, nice. So over here we got some other, you know, stuff in the background that you guys can actually walk to, which is really, really cool. This kind of reminds me of like, um, like the Capitol building, the way that it's set up. If you guys remember this tall building, then you have the long pond over here, then you have this building. It really looks familiar, right? <laughs> And then you have a football stadium, um, stadium, excuse me, and not that kind of football, ladies and gentlemen, soccer. So there's two different types of football, just in case you didn't know. American football, known as pigskin, and then you have the other football, which is known as soccer. Over here, you have the maze, as I mentioned. So you have one entrance over here, and then you exit out over here across the street. And I just really be making my rounds. <laughs> I love this segue, I swear. Um, and then you have over here a construction site. I don't know what's going to be put over here, but you can actually enter the construction site. Um, and then there's more stuff around the map as well. So, you know, just take the time to really explore your place. There's a bridge, but the other side of the bridge has no access. 
over here you have the um, bus station now this you don't actually build this is something that you know comes attached with the restaurant I mean with the um, supermarket oh look at the little mouse guy <laughs> so he buys all the imported cheese and he's fresh to death I love the outfit and look at grandma with her rollers and her hair she came out she came out to shop today <laughs> they got these little girls getting on the bus with their mom that is really really cool you got these little doges with these little um, hairstyles it's a cute little dog <laughs> but yeah the bus arrives and they enter the bus and the bu you know the bus also drops off customers as well so these guys are waiting for the bus and the bus takes a long long time to appear just gonna tell you that so if you're waiting for the bus yeah I feel bad for you oh there goes Batman he's leaving um, I would have expected a better car Batman but okay so over here you can actually build your own parking lot as well and there goes this, the other Batman <laughs> it's really really fun I love this place man I love this game it's really really cool now here's something that I discovered and you're probably gonna say this is kinda weird I don't understand the logic in it okay we just leveled up to level 21 so we unlocked the area and we got 10,000 cash right there nice alright so let me get off the segue real quick so if you see the shrubs and hedges thing you can walk over here and you can actually purchase a different style over here so right now I have the default which is not giving me any cash bonus but if I change it to one of these two I will receive a cash bonus and it's one percent you know one percent it does make it different so I would say if you are looking to get more cash definitely go with changing your shrubs but you don't necessarily have to you know um, because right now these two colors they're very disgusting um, I would have just left it green but let me just buy it you know because why not all right so we're using that one right there and we could buy this one for robux all right so now the bus is here so now you guys can see there it is so people get off and then people get on but you can't actually get on it'll disappear and boom it's gone <laughs> but the wait time is crazy and then you can see the um, the stations and every, everywhere that it goes so it has a tower city so these are probably places around the map that you know we haven't seen and everything like that um, what is this so we can actually hail a bus let me see okay so if you purchase this this is 25 robux so basically this is like making a bus appear faster making more customers coming there goes spider-man he's waiting for the bus he's going back to Queens <laughs> oh man oh there you go okay now you can see in the distance demon desire she has the VIP next to her name um, we also purchased these floating balloons in the air ladies and gentlemen so this is supposed to be like a cash bonus as well as you guys can see I have the welcome sign and a couple of balloons just floating there um, they don't leave they actually stay there so that's really really cool Wow spider-man showing up in groups the multiverse just exploded just now look at all these different versions of spider-man <laughs> I'm such a nerd um, over here you can upgrade your um, your theme to your supermarket so over here as you guys can see upgrading your theme will also give you a cash bonus so you have the OG market the convenience store look and then the modern theme as well and there might be one more if we scroll this over nope not yet alright so we have those three themes right there and as you guys can see it cost a lot this first one 16 million and then the other two you can get instantly using robux you can upgrade your market roof this is a robux option only and it gives you a two percent cash bonus for 500 robux the supermarket sky decor this is what I have well this parking sky decor is what I have 
but this one is also giving you cash bonuses as well so you can have a blimp flying over and a UFO for 300 Robux then lastly the parking sky decor so this is what I have right now so I can actually use both of them but I don't know if we can use both of them at the same exact time I kinda wanna buy it but I don't wanna lose another million dollars for no reason alright let's go for a expansion before we end off this video um, one thing about this game and you know the other existing games that I mentioned my restaurant and my arcade you do actually have to help out your um, employees so as you guys can see right now everything's moving smoothly but a lot of stuff it's still you know need to be restocked over here there's a shopping cart that somebody left over here I don't know why they left it there you know um, at least the good thing about this is they didn't go too realistic you know how you have like spills in certain out you know in owls and everything like that sometimes you gotta clean up certain things so these um you know these customers they don't spill things and everything like that but they will leave a shopping cart they will be um you know npcs that don't know exactly what to um come in and buy so sometimes you gotta stand there and talk to them and basically you just you just get them to i guess ultimately make up their mind on what they're going to purchase you have to put these shopping carts back manually now we do have people that actually help out but it's not as fast as you guys can see like if you come over here you got a bunch of people waiting for shopping carts instead of coming all the way over here they rather stand there and wait for me or the npcs to deliver the shopping carts right here so you got to keep everything moving so I don't understand like when you hire people and they're not doing the job it really doesn't make any sense to me alright so boom look he just brought over one cart and I took over three carts by myself over here you have NPCs that give you quests basically you come up to them and you complete something they're gonna give you either cash or they're gonna give you something for your supermarket so let's see what this guy is asking for alright so he says to arrange a toy car frame so luckily we did actually buy the toy car frame and once we set that up we're also gonna get another toy car frame for free so I just paid for one just to get another one for free doesn't make sense but it works you know um, usually there's two NPCs one over there and one like standing right here but I completed all the other NPCs quest so right now it's empty so what I'm gonna do is actually um, put down this toy rack and then I'm gonna expand and open this thing up um, let's see where can we place the toy rack um, yeah let's place it over here now I will actually um, change things up afterwards but for right now I'm just like leaving leaving this be the way it is alright so now we just unlock the new customer so I guess that person that they just showed is gonna be the person that buys the stuff from there alright let's see alright so he's stocking the toy shelf right now um, let's rotate this around Okay, do I want it against this wall like this? I mean, I guess, right? Put it right there for now. And now we got a little little doge. Another little doge. Okay, so there goes the toy cars right there. And there goes my man right on cue. Stocking the shelves. That's what's up, bro. Keep it moving. My employee of the month right here. She been flirting with me in the live stream. I don't know if you guys saw it or not, but... Shorty right here, she got employee of the month. She's been working hard. <laughs> I didn't even put her at this station. She just appeared over here as soon as I placed it down. We got a bunch of wolves coming. All of these guys just got off the bus. What? <laughs> what the heck? Bro. <laughs> All right. So now we got the toy rack down. We got some lollipops down. As you guys can see, the customers have these things over their heads so once it turns red that means they're really angry that you don't have the product 
So he's standing around and a bunch of stuff is actually already here. We have the toys over here and he's still standing there. There's raw meat and everything over here. So all the stuff that you need. Alright, so now he needs a pumpkin. Pumpkins are over that way, I believe. But yeah, usually you don't allow your customers to be mad. You want them to leave with that smiley face like you just saw over there. With and this girl, she's just standing there. I think she's lost. Okay, now she knows what she wants. <laughs> so see, the snowman is happy. He got what he wanted. Now he's leaving. Hopefully he puts the cart back. And yeah, he put the cart back and got his groceries. All right. So now we just walk up to this wall right here where it says 430,000 or 1,000 Robux and we can expand and open this place up. So let's open it up. And now look at that. We have the max right now of space. And also ladies and gentlemen, I want to add this as well when you have friends in the game with you you're gonna be receiving cash bonus so as you guys can see the fact that demon desire is actually here in the game with me I'm earning five percent more on my cash because she's here so that's really really awesome thanks for being here with me this entire time grinding and helping me out in the live stream if you watch that short video ladies and gentlemen that two minute video yes that is Sun Goku he is back with more racist remarks in my stream I don't know why he keeps showing up doing that but the whole situations over the robux giveaway him not getting any robux from me him using his grandma's passing as an excuse to get robux I told him the situation already and basically he's still angry about it so if you guys see him in chat, just try to ignore him, or if you want to curse him out and stuff like that, by all means. If you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like and subscribe right now to the channel if you guys are new. And don't forget to hit that share button as well. I'll catch you guys in the next upload. Peace!